Ah, oh, day two is dawned. And I think I should start another letter. Oh, boy. That gentleman and his brother have seen me. Well, Uncle Michael Deering, I'm going to write this letter as fast as I can because I could be facing some uh, untimely death in just a few moments here. Uh, so I guess I'll write it on this piece of stone since I still don't have any paper and I don't have... Oh, whew. Okay. Let's, let's find... <gasps> All right, we need to we need to lure them out of there. That's what we need. Towies! <gasps> oh boy! Okay, dear Uncle Michael Deering, uh, this is my second letter to you. I'm writing it as I run through the grass, and I am really afraid for my life. Uh, I have some. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go. We're gonna go far away. We're gonna let them. We're gonna let them be on their own. This is not to plan. This is not to plan. No, I don't want to go that far away. Actually, I want their bones. Their bones are the only thing that are going to keep me alive. I need to get them. Well, they are taking damage in the water. All right. Uh, Uncle Michael. I think I'm hidden. I'm hiding in a tall, grassy shrub as I write this to you. Yesterday, I found out the true depth of greed from the city folk. Although I am far from home and I'm on my own with a busted ankle, the villagers demanded gold for the service of delivering this post. I've lit out into the prairie and I've dug a small burrow near a watering hole. I've just ventured up into the dawn. I'm hungry and I fear these skeletons. But I'm going to keep the survival lessons that I learned while at your deli in mind. I learned them from Uncle John Fall 92 and Cousin Johnny Raichu. I must ask you... Has any word reached you yet of Ma and Pa? I fear the worst. Sincerest regards, Ron. Now, let's see if we can't lure these skeletons a little closer to me. I'm specifically talking about the ones that are bathing. <gasps> oh my gosh. That is going to make it extremely difficult. That is going to make it extremely... Oh! Hallelujah! Hallelujah, Bones. This was not my plan for today. Whoa. This was not my plan for today. Um, I feel like before I do anything, I need to go in there and get my bread. Because I'm going to start taking damage in just four little heart ticks here. And I am super, super curious what other people found in this challenge gosh i was i was really hoping that today would be the day that i get some wood and lure some chickens uh but it looks like today is going to be the day that i just continue to panic is this my watering hole no oh great and now i'm lost <laughs> oh boy goodness okay is that my watering hole Oh my gosh, they all look the same. <laughs> um, oh, this is so bad. This is such a bad way to start day one. Day two, day two, it's day two. Okay, is my watering hole over here? Okay, here we go. No, look at all these water, what kind of prairie is this? Oh, bones. Okay, these are the prairie bones. Are the bones of the, the bones of the prairie? No, the prairie of bones, this is, this is a really, where did my, oh, did I, I left my other reeds in. This is so fantastic. I lost my, it's that, right? It, isn't it? Oh my gosh, this is so embarrassing. I think I've lost. If it's this one over here, there should be one skeleton with a gold helmet to threaten me. It is this one. So they despawned. Okay. Huh, I didn't think I went that far. That's interesting. They despawned. They didn't die of... And here's what I need. Well, this has been a really interesting <laughs> day already. Uh, this is actually not safe. 
All right, let's just get some bread going here. This, this is so not the way I wanted this to go. I'm gonna need three bread, or three wheat, I should say, to make a bread, obviously. And we will replant. Oh, and we got two seeds? What? What? All right, we're gonna we're gonna try and bake these other one. Well, why am I not getting? Why is the earth so dry? Why am I not getting proper amount of seeds? I only have two bone meal left, so I need to hit some that looks like it's just about ready. Okay, well there's my extra seeds. Now I can make some bread. I can make two pieces, which isn't quite going to do it for me. Which isn't quite going to do it for me. I have no choice. I can't starve. And I am already way down on health. That is not going to do it for me. Oh my goodness. Okay, we need to plant these. We need to get our wood going. I think that was pity bread. I think the map just gave me some pity bread. Oh my goodness, out of my goodness. Uh, we will put these here. And then what I'm thinking of doing is putting some type of a blocking wall around this. I don't know if this is such a great idea. It's not going to keep spiders out. Uh, and this is similar to what I did in the my uh, multiplayer episode with Apidame, but I told, I told myself I wasn't going to do the same thing. And here I am, I'm basically doing the same thing because I'm afraid. <laughs> I am literally afraid of the world and my health right now. I mean my hunger, particularly. Oh, I can't do that because that's that's the lesson I learned. Skeletons will go under there. We don't want that. We don't want skeletons going under there. So we only want this. All right. All right, chickens. Chickens are what I really need for eggs. And then I'm going to need to go get some iron to make uh, a bucket. And then I can milk a cow. So what I really need the most right now is chickens. And I cannot kill animals and I cannot do any combating, any unwholesomeness stuff. Well, here's some wood. That's good anyway. It's not going to give me apples, but it is another source of wood, which isn't too bad. Oh man, I gotta tell you, this format of MHC is pretty scary. <laughs> uh, I don't. I felt like before I started playing, I was like, "Oh, this isn't any big deal. This is just uh, just don't harm any creatures." And then I started thinking about it, and I was like, "Oh, not harming any creatures means not fighting any mobs." All right, there aren't. There is no sign of. Ah, oh, thank God, chicken. All right, chicken, I'm going to give you a second to lay some to lay some eggs here while I slowly dig up this coal with this super inefficient wooden pick. I hope the chunk is still loaded with my house in it. I guess it's my underground burrow. Oh, lag, that was interesting. We're going to lure as many... Oh, gosh, eggs. Thank you. I think I need three eggs for a cake. So we're going to have to lure... Oh, my goodness. Asking you shall receive. That I like. All right, we're just going to take these three chickens back home. And then we're going to hope that we have time... Oh, come on. You guys need to walk a lot faster than that. I need, like, ideally six chickens is my ideal... Oh wait, I can't breed chickens anyway. I don't. I shouldn't bother to breed chickens because I can't. Uh... <gasps> oh, son! 
Oh, son, why are you going down so quickly? Why are you going down so quickly? I shouldn't bother to breed. I'm just going to have to take... There's an egg over there. I'm going to have to take as many of you as I can and leave the rest behind. Oh, this is, this is not going to turn out very well. This is not going to turn out very well. All right, we got four chickens. And we're going to be moving at a snail's pace. Okay, we can see the light. We're almost home. We can see the light. But these chickens must come with me because I can't fight. <gasps> oh, where are the mobs? The mobs are coming soon. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Do I have your attention? Do I have your attention? I have two of you. Oh, this is, this is so not how I planned my day to go. I had things I wanted to talk about. I had things I wanted to do. <laughs> I am so off plan right now. I am so off plan. Okay, and there goes the sun. All right, chickens. I am really counting on you. <gasps> A witch and an enderman. Neither of which I can deal with. If I do not survive, how will I get these letters? <gasps> A spider. Okay. Oh, against my better judgment. Oh, no. I can't punch you. Don't let me punch you. A against my better judgment, chickens. We're going to have to do something here. Come on. Where are you? Great. I got one chicken. I got one chicken. But we're going to have to do this because I do not trust. <gasps> oh, glory be. Oh, glory be. Holy moly, that is... Whoa! <laughs> what are the chances of that? What are the chances that that would occur? Oof! I may, I may completely change my plans for this MHC. I was planning to build a teepee and something else which I won't give away quite yet. And now, now I'm wondering if I might actually instead build a Conestoga wagon and get my butt off this prairie because this prairie life is this prairie life is hard especially when you screw up even making a simple furnace all right I have six I'm gonna put this here because that'll put some light up on the surface I'm gonna use a coal I know it's not the most um, boy that was lucky iron that was lucky iron. Coal is... Oh, I need three iron buckets, though. Uh, okay, I don't even know what I was about to say. I don't even know what I was about to say. But we have a bit of fortune smiling on us so far for living a wholesome life. I believe that trend shall continue. You do good by the map and the challenge. And the map and the challenge will do good by you. Now, since I am down here in a hole, I am going to have to turn on my F3 coordinates because I need to see when the day ticks over. Um, I don't want to do it too early. I'll give it a couple minutes as I dig. Wow, I was just so not... I was just so not planning to dig like this. I was going to try to find a cave. And I was going to go after proper gold so I can go send my letters in the village. All right, let's do this. This is my most important tool, second most important tool. Uh, these are actually important because these will lure, I guess, it might not be a bad idea for me to go ahead and plant some crops down here. I don't think I'm going to actually use the crops that are down here, but it might not be a bad idea just in case something like this happens again where I get stranded in a hole. Uh, I'm just going to plant three. I know I just did, I did more slots than that. I'm going to do three because three is what you need for bread, and I don't have any. Uh, I'm not worried about that coal right now. 
Oh shoot, I'm going to take a lot of hunger going back up. Ah, uh, well, that's the choice I made by coming down here, I suppose. Actually, I guess I could get to the bottom and I could make stairs. So that I'm not doing jumping. That's, that is like one of the most key hunger inducing things in Minecraft. Besides running, sprinting, and the combination of sprinting and jumping while it's super fast, it's also super dangerous. Now, it does occur to me that I might be near extreme hills. In which case, oh, I am. Oh, this is so not good. Okay. If I see that one of these blocks is taking a long time, then that means it's a silverfish. So I actually need to be super careful about that as well. Because I will not be able to fend off those silverfish. I will have to run for it. Which will certainly sap my hunger. How are we doing on time? I kind of wish... kind of wish this was a display of how much time was left in the day. Alright, we're just going to... Unfortunately, we're going to have this up. I don't know if there's a hotkey that will allow me to not have all this other stuff on the screen and just have the day. Because that's actually all I really want to see. Okay, there goes that. There comes another. Not seeing any sign of gold, any sign of uh, anything else of use to me right now. When I did this in multiplayer, oh, you know what? I don't need the coal. I need to focus. I need to focus. Uh, when I did this in multiplayer, we did not really do much about armor until quite a ways in. It just wasn't really something to worry about because at the point we were at, if we would have gotten attacked by mobs, we would basically be finished armor or no armor. So I'm going to... I'm going to do that here and not go after a whole bunch of armor. If I get the extra iron, I will certainly make it. If not, then so be it. But my hope right now is that I will run across a little more iron for a, a third bucket. I think I have six iron. Yeah, I do have six iron up above. That's not going to be enough for a cake. I'm going for cake. And uh, once I can get established, I will go try to find some stupid pumpkins so that I can go for pumpkin pie, which is way better than cake. Well, yeah, it is better than cake, I think. It costs a lot less. It's a lot easier to make. Oh, man, I went all the way down to Bedrock and I didn't get, I didn't get nothing. Oh, that means I have to waste more wood on an extra crafting table. Because I can't really afford to walk up these stairs. I mean, walk, jump up the blocks and waste more hunger. I literally think I have to do this to survive. Oh my gosh, for a split second I thought that was a silverfish. I'm going to be like, oh now see there's a cave somewhere near me. Okay, if I can just keep, oh god, don't let any of these be silverfish, please. Please. <laughs> I'm wholesome, I swear. I'm good. I'm doing my best. Uh, let's talk about the May MHC. The May Minecraft Hardcore Challenge was pretty cool. Uh, I think it was the first one I participated in. It's the second one, I believe, that I'm aware of. Uh, I was too late to join April. And in May, uh, which seems like so long ago, I actually, it's almost been two months since I recorded the May Hardcore, my May Hardcore episode. Uh, even though it's only June and May is just around the river bend. Uh, in May, the idea was to build a deli, a delicatessen or a restaurant, and stock it with one of each type of edible food in the game, including, including food from mobs. Uh, we didn't have any rules about not killing mobs, so that was nice. It was a good one for me to start on. Uh, I f oh, day three. 